creating your own reality. Let's talk about it. And the reason why I wanted to talk about this particular topic is because it resonates with me so well. And when it comes to life experiences itself, I'm able to relate because in the past, the way that I think now, it was not the way that I was thinking before. It would be like, I would think about, you know, having a positive day, but then it's like, you know, when you wake up and you feel some type of way and it's like, it messes up your whole entire day. That's what kind of mind frame that I was on. It was like, I was trying to shift on thinking about being positive, but something would trigger it. And, you know, next thing you know, my whole entire day is screwed up because of another person and things like that. So the reason why that I'm talking about this topic is because I feel as if what I'm saying can actually be helping someone that is out there right now and who's listening. And just for some people in general, you know, you may be able to relate to what I'm saying or you may be actually going through what I'm talking about at this particular moment. But the reason why this topic, it is so dear to me is because a lot of people always say that um, I'm very calm, you know, at times as if with other people would be like in an uproar. But with that, it took a lot of life experiences itself. For example, right, I used to work at this job and this particular job, it was very stressful to the point that I didn't actually want it to go to this place. You know, it's like, soon as I even walk on the premises of the establishment, I really didn't want to be there. It was just like, my energy, everything would just shift as if like, why am I here? Like, I feel unworthy, I feel this way, you know? And I always told myself never again that I would feel that way, going to a place of um, business, you know, even if I'm working somewhere, you know, I would never put myself through that because I would definitely say that place has taught me so much. And I'm happy that I have gone through that that situation to get me where I'm at now. I always told myself and through a lot of different readings and things like that, I feel as if the universe comes in full circle. And what I mean by that is I feel like another situation can come about and it would be as if it was the same situation you have gone through. So it's kind of like deja vu, it comes back again. So, you know, I always told myself that whenever this come about again, I would not allow different energies to you know come upon me and get me to where a place as if I'm feeling unworthy of myself I'm feeling that I am just here and you don't appreciate you know what I do and the things that I do for the company or just in general so when it comes to creating your own happiness it does start with yourself you get what I'm saying it really does because if you wake up in the morning and you automatically thinking like you know what I'm about to have a bad day. You know, my entire day is about to be bad. It's kind of like you already manifest that day already before it has even started. So it's kind of like you already putting out that type of energy that is out there. So it's kind of like already working in full circle. So that's how you're feeling. That's what kind of day you're going to have. But if you just change that thought, you know, change that thought process just for a split second, that can definitely make a difference. So that's why a lot of people always ask me like, why are you so calm at certain situations? You know, like people be like upset, angry, and I'm just so chill. And it's because of just life experiences. Sometimes when you know what things are and what it is, it's like, what's the point of being upset? What's the point of, you know, I'm getting upset and it's not even my fault, for example. You get what I'm saying? Like, what's the point of it all? Like once you change your change of thought, and you take things for what it is, you start thinking logically about things, it can make a total difference. Trust me. And you gotta believe in yourself. That's one thing. You know, start saying like affirmations. You get what I'm saying? You wake up in the morning, you can just wake up and say, I am worthy, I am gonna have a great day. I am wise, I am beautiful, I am strong, I am powerful. I am willing to learn. I would not fear anything. Like, you get what I'm saying? When you say things like that, it makes a difference in your mindset. It's like once you start taking action of things that you read or you take in perspective of how something can make a difference, you will notice the difference in yourself. You definitely will. 
that's why I always say the universe is mental and the mind is all. Like that right there itself is real. If you're around a whole bunch of negative people, that energy is going to shift off on you and you're going to become negative, even if you're not really trying to do so. But it's just like, it's an energy shifter. So it's like, when it comes to your mind, you have to be able to control within what you're going through. I just want to stop by just for a little moment, just to give my opinion on, you know, creating your own reality. So when it comes to creating your own reality, do things that makes you happy. Do things that makes you feel worthy. And don't be around a lot of negativity. Even if you do be around negativity, you got to be able to block that. Don't let that energy shift off on you. And you're having an awesome day and someone coming into your job. Or, you know, you're going to the store and someone's already pissed off. And then guess what? They trigger you and you become pissed off. And it takes, I'm not even going to lie, it takes a lot. It takes strength because... Sometimes I look at myself and I'm just like, wow, you have came a long way, but I just want to say it can be done. So just take it day by day, you know, take it step by step. Don't rush it. Just start doing small things. Start thinking positive. You know that you got to go to work and you feel as if like, oh man, I'm rushing. I'm not going to make, I'm not going to be able to make it on time. Just start thinking like, you know what? I'm going to make it on time. Start putting it out there that you are going to make it on time instead of waking up like, oh my goodness, I'm late for work. You know, it's kind of like you have to change your thinking process. And once you start with that and manifesting what you want in life to become your reality, that's when you actually will start noticing a difference. And don't just listen to me. I'm just giving you my opinion. I feel about the situation and how I feel as if it does makes a difference. So leave your comments below. And, you know, just let me know what do you think about, just let me know how do you feel when it comes to creating your own happiness, to creating your own reality. Do you believe in that? Do you feel as if you can do that? Feel free. And until next time, peace.